Okay, well, I have a shoe here. So um, the normal wear pattern is probably the first thing for me to talk through, and then we can talk through deviations of that. We would expect to see a contact around posterior lateral heel, so basically in the back, on the outside back of the heel in that area. We would then expect to see it rotate inwards and then off over the second toe, so pretty much following the line of that. So a lot of one of the ways to tell a running trainer is that it has tread that runs in a direction but then will tend to curl off over the big toe so it's trying to guide you in that direction as well so someone who's pronated a lot you may see a bigger wear pattern or a longer wear pattern on there wear pattern if they're very over pronated or they have rolled the heel a lot you may see a lot of wear on the inside or the medial side of the heel probably more significantly is in the forefoot a pronator or someone who's pronated throughout stance would end up having a lot of wear under here and you may even start to see your toe rubs where the ball of the toe and the actual toe contact the ground for a longer period of time. A supinator would pretty much be the opposite. So you again would see a lot of contact around here but it tends to be further forward as well uh, and you'd tend to see a lot of wear towards the outside of the, the sole. The other thing that is a delicate one to read is the angle of wear. So some people just slide their foot in a lot so that doesn't mean you're a pronator or a supinator, it just means that you slide, you're, you aren't really aware of that trainer. So a new trainer, you'll tend to wear at the back anyway, so it, you have to do several miles in the train to be able to work that sort of thing out. Um, the other thing that you would see with a pronator or a supinator, pronators will often have bulge out a trainer here or bulge out a trainer there. You might see the toe starting to poke up through the top or changes in where you bend the or flex the trainer there. So they're some of the things I'd look for. Supinator, the opposite um, uh, sort of thing may occur.